all righty then we are back and i've been gone for another week so my glorious voice has returned for operations wicked turkeys i am also followed by a one mr king go ahead and say hi king if you can hello there he is all right and i'm gonna shove him back in the closet and continue <laughs> with the opening here <laughs> um <laughs> That's my bad. Now nah, you're good. Okay, so commands, actually, how do I usually do this? Yeah, we're going to go over commands. All right, commands for tonight consists for two teams. We have the INS and the British. For the INS forces, for the commands loadout, we have, well, not loadout, command structure is going to be Inquisition with his two IC being Bow, his three other SLs being Frost, Raggy, and Raph. For the British side, we have Command being Phoenix with his two IC being Hanu, his three other SLs being Morgan, Zaki, and Utopian. Uh, for the team loadouts, for the INS, as I find them in the op doc, for the INS, their infantry squad level is going to be one SL, a two, no, nope, one SL, one FTL, one Scout, two ARs, and one Medic. Platoon level is going to be two MGs, eight lats, two ammo bearers, and ten raiders. Vehicles consist of one armored dishkateki and four trans techies. Let's see here. Fob and logistics is one drone. And when conditions met, they have six 81 millimeter mortar barrages for six rounds. For the British side, infantry squad level is going to be one SL, two FTLs, two ARs, one lat, and one medic. Platoon, wow, platoon armory uh is kind of split up here so we have one to three squads will be two ammo bears and four plus squads will be two mgs and four ammo bears uh which you'll get in the stream is just the maximum uh vehicles it consists of three logistical trucks 500 ammo 2500 build i believe that's each uh one bulldog fob consists of various defensive structures for the cop and support is a four 81 millimeter six round barrages and a fa18 hornet bomb as and moving on over to the operations map as uh, you can see we have two potential cops for the british forces uh, one in the north and one in the south and it is the job of the ins to assault those with that out of the way, I will now bring y'all straight in, and we'll listen okay. and Party communicate with each other. Party boys, we've got some enemies or some outposts to take. Uh, we have the British, they are trying to colonize us again, and I don't like that. So we are going to try to force them away from our land. So, our job is to basically push in on Fox Trot 5. Take out the uh, enemy uh, outpost there, hold it, and kill anyone inside. Uh, as you guys can see on the map, uh, we have markers showing each squad and their plan and, what, and where we're gonna go. And your squad leaders are going to explain to you uh, in specific details on what's happening. So, uh, we're gonna push in from uh, the north, northwest and northeast side while having on the east side cover from squad 5 and we're gonna push in and hold that uh, outpost and kill everyone inside. Uh, what do you guys, do you guys have any questions? No questions? No. ROE? <laughs> Yeah, we'll all so, yeah, basically, yes. Rules of engagement, we are going uh, contact first with your squad leader to tell you to shoot or not to shoot. But if you're in immediate danger, that basically means that the enemy is on top of you, then you are free to shoot, then call out your contact report. I'll copy. It's fine to be sneaky, and that's the main idea. Do you guys copy? Copy, bro. Copy. That. Copy. Okay. Any more questions? Okay, no more questions. Fantastic. Oh no! <laughs> Inquisition's not there. Wait, oh, I think he just perfect. came back. Command to all squads. All right, so it looks like the majority of Hanu squads actually holding that uh, northeast of the sector. Two IC. He's in command for now. 
Uh, all right. Understood. It looks like uh, Inquisition has relinquished command at the moment to his 2 IC. Well, hopefully they all know the plan and they're going to stick to it. Well, they should know the plan. I, on the other hand, have no idea what the plan is. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, no. Uh, I don't even need to know what the plan is because I already said what it was going to be. They're, they're, uh, you remember what I was saying about going north? Yep. They're going north. Yep, that's kind of what I figured. I saw their one, two, and four marks on the map. Yeah. Well, this is going to be interesting. Looks like one's going to be a diversion, two is going to be coming up the, oh, that is going to suck. And there. then four, and is it just four going there? Yeah, there's just four yeah. squads, and then you got frost down in the south. Yeah, okay. Um, but, I mean, the problem is is two, I think, is probably going to make the most headway. I think they're going to use four as a base of fire. One's probably going to get chopped up with two. Squad two on the uh, British forces. Well, it depends. Remember, players have a tendency of getting extremely tunnel visioned. Yes. Albeit, but... granted, I do see an Alpha Guido sitting downhill over here. Well... Oh, we've already got firing? ND. Was it ND? Oh, uh, I don't know. Salty Toast and those guys are there close to the southeast. I don't think anyone's got view on anyone at the moment. And that sounded like an ND. That, yeah, no one should have view. We've got Nick, Salty, and Gordo here real close to the, uh, the northern uh, cop location. NG. Yeah. Uh, uh, it looks like uh, Bullet Sponge and NG, Alpha Guido NG, sorry, are scouting at the moment fire. into the line Boom. for the uh, INS. Not for me. Not for me. Copy. I'll tell you, four gets on that uh, Foxtrot nine or Foxtrot four ridge. So they'll have a beautiful sight onto the British forces. Right. Uh, and it is just confirmed the ND was not on the INS side, so uh, someone is about uh, two to three mics out. Someone some, did something. Some little <laughs> Brit just uh, had to let it loose. Morgan was trying to slip. confirm if that was one of them or not. Someone, someone's too itchy right now. Just a bit. Well, they get in position. I'm going to see what Frost and his guys are doing. Go for five. Uh, keep in mind, uh, we've been forward event admins that our target is Fox 5. Reminder, guys, to stay off of the Fox 6, or the E, E9, whatever the other compound is, and not to approach it. And yeah, we're as just far as we should be making here. sure that everyone on the INS is in the same page, or on the same page. Uh, the target is the Fox 5, not the Fox 6. No, no, it's not Fox 6. The uh, Fox... Eight. No, it's Fox Nine. Yeah. Right. Uh, squad One is holding position. I am, for some reason, Copy. becoming extremely bad at reading maps. <laughs> yeah, it happens to me all the time. I always say east when I mean west, and west when I mean east. You mean Probably. west? Yeah. This, I should just start saying <laughs> that from now on, and let people figure it out from there. Uh. I kind of want to go and bleach my brain now because I use that. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like uh, Frost guys are just screening here. Um, we've got uh, B car is kind of scanning over there. Uh, I'm keeping an eye on Alpha. Depending on whether or not Alpha sees the incoming crew, the INS, that's uh, squad two for the INS. Squad five, will depend on how this engagement yes, goes. Uh, per event admin, please pull now I didn't your check Bravo the rules. Are they allowed to QRF at first contact? Gotcha. I believe it is first contact. Okay. Uh, you can that check would make the. Sense. Uh, uh, I will... Let me check the op doc here. Uh, British. That's the objective before live. No, we don't got that. There's special rules somewhere. It's like uh, Alpha's Alpha and Bullet are definitely gonna get that first contact though. Uh, I mean, they are squads, squad within fifty meters. And Alpha can see anything like a hawk. 
Yeah. It's very frustrating when you're playing against him. <laughs> yeah, I have noticed that. A lot of people do not like playing against him. Um, yeah, no, there's no spe specifications on how the uh, force is supposed to come out. So They left I think their it's... QRF at Delta 8, Delta 8-8. Eight, eight. Um, we'll see. Did they? Yep. They're they're not at main. They're kind of just northwest of the southern cop location. Maybe they have uh, a uh, specified starting position. Might be that. Um, but we'll that we'll see. That seems a little odd. That bulldog will come uh, rumbling and bumbling once they're ready, making a lot right. of noise. It looks like the forces are in position, except for. Squad 4 is still trying to get there, but Squad 2 and 1 are where they need to be. It looks like Frost groups also where they need to be. Uh, anyone spotted anyone on the uh, British side? We have not seen anything. Everything's status quo right now. Um, I am looking at Alpha's position right now. Alpha, I mean, they're about right he on is, top of them. Yeah, he's down. he's downwind from them directly. Uh, Bullet Sponge might become a literal reenactment of his Bullet name sponge. <laughs> oh uh, that's great depending on whether or not people can see him the camo does work quite well on this map for the british yeah it definitely does Squad that is approaching target location i'll let you know once we're set i mean i can uh, if bullet sponge hold two, still it'd be fine because i can yeah. barely see we're alpha if i'm out just a little bit uh, one uh, does not have if he just on. peaks northeast he'd see yeah, these guys copy. poking out they didn't want to trickle the uh, reinforcement. He might not want to. You got close. Apex with that MG3 looking Understood. down that way right now. Oh, yeah. Moving in. Uh, position. Wait, aren't there two compounds we need to take? No, just one. And see, even there's some confusion yeah, here uh, on the ground I'm hearing is people are like, aren't we supposed to be taking two compounds, not one? Ah. Misinterpretation of the op documents. Oh, oh, they're moving Seneca and e Fink up to the hill, right up to Lawn and uh, Bow. Oh, no. Hanu just called him out. I, one is eyes on. Sandbags and uh, stuff to our southwest. Wait, they're sending two men against an entire... Well, they don't know that that's there. Maybe they think it's a scouting crew? Well, yep, and you've got Jay Rimmick and uh, Fulcrum, who's in a good position to provide cover. Alright, let's see... See if it pans out that way. Not really any particular call-outs right now. And we've got... Um, I, I Alpha's right. had to see them. Alright, Charlie, we're holding here. He has Most not. Definitely. Definitely. Uh, may have been spotted. He, well, he's not looking in that direction. Can we open fire? But they're running yeah, right uh, up. Open up. Bullet has to see them. Uh, all squads Bullet sees them. He's gonna. Yep, Bullet he's takes a shot. There is flame. I got contacts oh. myself. Bar talk took a hit. Basket took a hit. Best puppies down, not the puppies. This was really quick. Yeah, there goes close. Bullet. Yeah, Bullet's just become a literal portion of his name. Uh, Alpha oh. Guido's still hiding behind the rock, I think. Can't see him from here. Bartok's yeah. being aggressive here. Nope, he's crawling out. Alpha is getting into the lower ground. Yep. He's going to try to probably disengage and get away. <laughs> yeah. Again. Or get behind him. I got, I got, I got hey, they took out three down. with him, though. That was a good uh, good trade there for the defenders. Most definitely. But they're going to have to... Remember how I was saying? they got to do this at, like a lightning strike. It's... They gotta move fast, or that uh, reinforcements are gonna get here, and it's gonna be much more difficult. QRF is inbound too. They're moving up the Delta Delta Six right now, heading north. Yeah, they uh, pretty much been head off, headed off uh, at all their points. The contacts between us. My pause two eighteen. I mean, that was just. Give me a light suppression, guys. Those plans just, just coincided with each other with those little OPs too. Just taps, just taps. Got Seneca and Efank disengaging from those guys. Looks like Raggy's gonna start producing hey, uh, cover fire, uh, uh, particularly for us. who. Looks like Alpha's gonna get out of there. Yep, Alpha's pulling back to his crew. I've got Nick of Time up here with the armored Dishka's not moving yet. 
I think they're waiting for the uh, reinforcements to show up, but they've got a nice view down the main road here. That is... I don't know how they haven't spotted. I was kind of thinking they were going to... I, I have not heard anything from them so far. I think they're too tied up at their OP on the northeast. Okay. Uh, one just got disengaged, or dismounted at Delta 5. Looks like they're moving to maneuver on 4 for the INS okay. with Bow Squad. Gordo's starting to open up. Squad five, uh, give command back, tank position. Yep, they called out Gordo Three, and Nick's uh, How close are they? armored Dishka. Yeah, okay, I see. You got Utopian's crew coming up with Nightmare. Ah, uh, he's got Nightmare. <laughs> uh, it's been a while since I've seen him in here. Wait, it's only a four man, but uh, Nightmare, is it? Um, yeah, it's your nightmare. nightmare. Yeah, I, I, just, I remember I just, when I <laughs> when I kept reading his name when I first started it. I kept calling him unknown. I read the first two letters and I'm like, oh, it's unknown. But it's your. Yeah, like that's I, not right. <laughs> I'll be honest. Every time I talk to him, I never say your. Yeah, everyone just calls him nightmare. Can you suppress for squad two? What about uh, it? I'll squad four to check their fire. Firm, doing it now. INS has good spread on them. Um, squad two, command for squad two. Again, they're just not being super Perfect. aggressive. Oh, uh, definitely not. Uh, when you get the chance, and that's going to make this a slugfest. And squad one is sending their bulldog to pick up squad four in command. I can try. I'm in a pretty Actually, command is on foot, moving north. Directly. I don't know what they're gonna do with that bulldog. That they can use it. Link up with four, link up with one, they can, they can lay down a hurt. And it looks here. like the Dishkateki is now laying down the hurt on the uh, cop. I, I got a heavy, uh, sent back position to Trying to take out the uh, to, uh, to Logi tractor they brought in. Not sure why they're doing that, but. Scott okay. gonna be pushing south now. Bartok says like, is that clear, Phoenix so out in the middle him. of the forest? Yep, he's uh. Squad two, this is four. We're doing he our just best decided to, to huff it. Uh, let us know if you agree okay. To any okay. Position. To each their own, I guess. And we're about to have some interesting action here. Utopian's crew is coming right up on the back of Squad Four. Command for Squad Two. Once you cross, I'm excited for that. Uh, this is this natural line of drift that uh. Scottish, uh, Raff, and Bartok is taking um, up towards the cop. They're going to get up to the close of the cop quick. They're just going to push it directly from the north. Yeah, and it looks like Londarts has separated himself alongside B from the uh, hilltop for Squad 4. So, this, odds are if this, this engagement be, goes, they're probably going to be the last one surviving. Uh, yeah, this could be disastrous for uh, the INS here. Uh, we're about to get oh, yeah. Much of this shit. I don't know who's going to have interaction first. I hate it when there's multiple points of contention. My paws, how close the I know. It's yep. really hard to keep an eye on all of them. It definitely is. Yep, we've got... Bartok, Raf, and that crew, they're, they're slowly making their way uh, southbound, but uh, I think the real contact's going to come out Squad of two, all we Utopian's have is, crew. Uh, white smoke southwest of two. Uh, no confirmation on contact. My Bravo is moving towards two to support. I two, don't know why really they tossed the white smoke down here uh, for the British. Looks like Efank e and Seneca possibly drawing the attention the of the hilltop crew over here for Squad 4. Who is now being taken out by Nightmare. There goes Lagar and Jewel. Uh, Armor Soul, Army Soul is also out. Hold, hold. We can't, we are taking fire. We're not able to assist. Balchica is currently calling for a hold on comm and is currently unavailable to provide long distance assistance to the rest. Yep, I Utopian's calling. So. They just dropped a fire team element size group so far, and foul squads really just stretched thin now. Yep. Looks He's like got, Lana uh, Beef's trying to flank. Well, sooner or later, Bow's going to get spotted because he's got Utopian right above him. And here comes uh, Frog. 
I hope that's how you pronounce that. <laughs> and it looks like Frog sees Val. Looks like, uh, and we've got main objective being assaulted right now. Bartok yep. with a lat out hits no one. Uh, squad four is Morgan was explaining that he's uh, he's got no west. coverage to the south and no eyes south because how pinned down he is. So. Frost squad could do a some damage out. here. No kills still. Wow. Bartok is not doing so hot today with the lats. Oh, Lawn and Beef coming up on the rear here. Command is four. I'm too effective. Plus I feel like you just said Operating that. Surprise is down by Lawn. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, Lawn's victory will be short-lived because we've got Zaki's entire squad coming to mop it up. Yeah, I'm seeing that. All right, moving back to the main over here. Yeah, it looks like Bartok's crew here is just kind of bogged. Without that long distance fire, they can't move any closer. And unfortunately, they're going to be caught in a crossfire here with uh, oh, yeah. Hanu's squad and a little bit of Fulcrum and Remick. Uh, squad one, I Good movements from the British forces, not so much for the uh, INS. Would have worked if they had acted faster. Yeah, definitely speed is the key on when your uh, unconventional force is trying to hit these cops. Yeah, we're going to follow Londarts here and see what he is up to. It looks like he's trying to wrap around the element, which is not good because that is a bulldog. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, straight off the front armor. He hits it in the face. But... But the gunner's still alive, that's not good. But it looks like uh, Schmoodle squad. is currently squad four. Uh, pulling out. Looks like Bakar and Santo and his crew are looking down on top of him as well. But we've got here down on the south, it's going to be developing right. nicely with Frost yeah, Squad. They they're, uh, they've you. got a nice wide line and they're moving north. All right, looks like Londarts might try the crawling method to stay incognito, but they are. Oh, nope, it looks like... Who was that? Was that Beef or was that Dart? It was Londarts. It has been taken out. Beef is the only one up. I'll copy. Copy that. Five copies. We've got, uh... Okay, Raph and grenade range with here with Remick. With let's go, let's Be go. Careful. There was people south as well. yep. Trying to find a good angle for this. Hillside hillsides are not the best for cameras. Okay. Apex 69er. Oh, here comes Bartok coming up on Fulcrum. Yeah, watching that. Zeneca just went down to, uh, looks like Silent took him out. Raph is hit. playing it dangerous over here. We got Raph. Oh man, he's exposing himself. Well, luckily Phoenix is looking to his southwest south. And they have no oh, 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 there goes Raph. Who got him? I think that was Efang. Inside the compound, watching the exit as you're and Bartok has taken over the hilltop uh, emplacement. Uh, command. Copy. Got We're fours coming to reinforce. Looks like they'll run into Echo Frost four, squad. Six, Frost might be able to get set up on that hill though. Scottish keeping an eye in the direction for Efank and Phoenix. And Beef is currently command, still squad, left five. all alone in the back line. Can you send your western fire team north to cover squad 2, please? Looks like Morgan's condensing his leftover forces to hold the cop. Yeah, and looks like Raggy is still squad, not one. past this defensive bunker. Yeah, go for one. yeah they, they put that in a perfect position to hold up a squad. Copy. Can you use the armored and Alpha's just charging. Of course he is. We'll do our best. Copy. 
Alpha might get shredded by that 50. Nope, oh, and down goes Alpha. Ah, your positions were perfect. The issue is you didn't. And didn't now they're all charging and expose themselves. Yeah, close contact. Unfortunate. Lost real, and we lost uh, Alpha to that little counterattack. Looks like Polish and Zero Minus are currently laying down some fire on the hilltop where Squad 4 was. Uh, Hatchling Slasher just got taken out by, I think it was Zaki. Zaki, someone took out Trigger. You see the lines got really intermixed here. Oh yeah, there is this so is much a... intermixing right now. We've got still Utopian's whole squad just holding security. I'm wondering why they're not coming in to support. That Dishkoteki gets, uh, takes that hill where Hanu is. They're going to be in trouble. Mm. Hanu just went down. Yeah, yeah, Hanu's gone. Yeah, I got close contact to myself. Raggy's starting to clean up this cop. I've only got, uh, yeah, it King's looks like the Dishkoteki has actually lost its crew. They have abandoned the Dishkoteki. So I ain't got to worry about that now. Got Unless Apex on, back for it. Apex on the wall, going to be trying to breach the compound himself. Oh, Shorty Fulcrum. Looks like Morgan. And he's dead. Flat to the face, or a bomb, or a uh, grenade. It's like there's Viper and Ghost and Morgan left. They're going to hold a strong defense, that's for sure. If you are currently in the op and you have died, it's shift P. Uh, we're progressing quite well, trying to see if there's enemies between us. I, I got at least it's like Zaki's squad was able to, to secure west. most of and push back Frost squad. But, uh, uh, push there. Bartok just got executed by E. Fank and Phoenix. Like. Horribly. That was just two man <laughs> came up, popped up, and just unloaded. That is that was sad. Who we've got left. We just got Scottish there, and looks like the rest is all to their southeast and east. Yep, Scottish is the only one left down here. Somehow he is still alive. But we're gonna go focus on the south southeast. See what the rest of the INS forces can do. They have still yet to breach. I think 69er was the only one who got close, and that is a questionable maneuver there, whether or not he was supposed to be doing that. Yeah. Um, looks, like, looks like Scottish... Nope, Scottish still isn't down. He's holding on with oh, half a squad on him. Is Scottish? Where is Scottish? Scottish is up over here by that northwest... Oh, right, uh, right, yeah. Oh, OP. Well, they know he's there, they just don't know where. And it's gonna cost Zaki his life. Yeah, there goes Zaki, but Zaki was a great, great distraction for Toxic Viper to come in and uh, clean up Mr. Scottish. The old rabbit. It's kind of like uh, breaching a room. You know the first person into the room is probably gonna die. Someone's but, gotta run the rabbit. Yep, someone's gotta do it. Looks like we've got Nick and Raggy starting to maneuver. Um, the Frost squad's probably in the best position right now. Yeah, Bulldog is starting to come Dave back as well. well Death, Death has pulled out his uh, lat. Not sure what he plans on using it against. We've got Frog and Nightmare inserting between uh, Raggy squad and INS command as well. Inquisition might be able to catch him in the back here. Maybe. <laughs> Nightmare's frustrated because how the uh, bulldog you can hear for miles. Yeah. That's and it looks like the bulldog is coming up the. What is shooting out the bulldog? Oh, they've taken up position in the. Uh, INS has taken up position in the bunker here. And it's just lighting that uh, poor bulldog up with 
whatever Liberal they got. Liberal just went down to Frog and Nightmare at the old cop location for uh, Hanu Squad on the northeast. Oh. oh. Yep, Nightmare and Frog inserted there. They had a, a good flank. Now the Bulldog's suppressing. Okay. Position. We get a flank from the northeast and suppressed by the uh, bulldog to our west. Looks like command's called out. He's got 14 guys left and effective. So we'll see how this pans out. Utopian looks like he might go down to Inquisition. Yeah, quick, give me a number. What's uh, what's left for each team? We've got 14 for the British and one, two, three, five, six, seven. Looks like eight for the INS. Ooh, not looking good for the INS. I mean, I could already tell by the way this was paying out, but still. Inquisition just took out Florida. The gunner for the Bulldog. No, no point in opening up the map. There's too many cameras now. <laughs> Nightmare just dropped Raggy. Looks like um, Amboss is the only one left there. Got a little 1v1 action. And down goes Ampos. Nightmare, the cleanup crew. And Silent just went down, trying to cross out in the open. Left with Frost, Grunt, and DJ Russ. Man, I have let this camera work just slip. I am not, <laughs> not where I'm supposed to be most of the time here. This is not good. You can, uh, you can blame it on me. I'm taking up too much of your uh, attention span. That's for sure. No, it's not even that. It's just, I am not awake. <laughs> Looks like Inquisition is pulling back to link up with Frost and crew. Frost's currently smoke. trying to crawl across a road, so... I don't know how well e that's going to work. e -Fank and Phoenix are in some uh, throw smoke solid for spots. Uh, push in after smokes if you feel it safe. Sounds good. It looks like Frost is being sent on a one-man roll by Inquisition to try and take the cop. <laughs> smokes all down. Well, best of I say one-man, but I think situation. he's got Grunt and... Uh, Russ current in the back line, so I think they'll be pushing with him. Looks like Inquisition's trying to provide some cover fire, but uh, looks like it's to no anvil. Uh, hey, Twitch stole my name. Uh, currently, we are uh, dealing with the first round of our structured operation. Oop, there went Frost. Poor, poor Frost. Didn't even make it across the road. I think that was a nightmare who finally got him. Um, this is our one life operation for squad. And, uh, yeah. As you can see, the INS forces currently are not doing so hot. Uh, looks like command also went down for the INS. I hope I don't die. Yep, I there is no commands I did left. Catch it's, that. it's, yeah, neither did I. Um,. Oh, it's like we've just I got Russ and Grunt. Yep. So, we're going to have some fun here. Oh, yeah, I see him at the same bags. Yep. Yeah, uh, Looks a guy like B Car and his fire team kind took the old position that Hanu was on. They're going to hold that pretty strong. Back. Yep, Nightmare Spy Grunt, or Russ, whichever. Yeah, I think that's Russ Nightmare. Okay. Is that Nightmare shooting? Uh, yes, I believe he is at the AR over there, putting on some heavy fire. Yep. Well, we're going to find out. Called him out. I wonder if we're going to see the, uh, the fabled uh, start moving or get bombed uh, event admin. Seems uh seems like um 
both teams kind of forgot that they had their these assets available. Yeah, yeah. I just noticed that. Unless, unless I wasn't paying attention during the uh, meeting, unless they removed those functions. Let me see. I can double check that. I know the Opdoc says they have them, but... Opdoc says it, and they haven't called any changes that I've heard of. Um, just looks like it wasn't wasn't utilized which you know could have could have tipped it into the scales to the INS or British I mean they've yeah. got a lot of assets available well, down goes Russ I think that was either Econ incognito burrito or uh, Phoenix got him what a I'm good not gonna name. lie that is a good name yeah that's, <laughs> that's perfect I yeah. was saying that when I saw him in pre-op that's awesome all right that's gonna leave and run grunt. grunt is down who got him uh I think it was efink was it Efink? Where's Efink? It was Efink or Phoenix. He's back a little bit to the north of uh, Mr. Incognito Burrito. Oh, okay. All Chopped right. Well, we'll win. be. We yeah, that'll be a win for the British. We'll be right back shortly for round two. All right, we're back for round two, and it's finally gotten to the point where I can actually go over things and not bring y'all in and there's not anything going on all right so for round two commands we are gonna have a flip-flop so for the ins command will be phoenix with his two eyes being hanu for his three other sls we got morgan zaki and utopian for the british side we have inquisition oh, wow inquisition inquisition as command i still think i fucked up that uh, two IC is going to be Bao, and his three other SL is going to be Frost, Raggy, and Wrath. I really need to fix my sleep schedule. Um, for loadouts, real quick, for the loadouts for the INS side, we have infantry squad levels going to be one SL, one FTL, one scout, two ARs, one medic, platoon army has two MMGs, eight LATs, two ammo bearers, and ten raiders. Vehicles consist of one armored Dishkatechi, four trans techies, fob and logistics consist of one drone with when conditions met. They also have six 81 millimeter mortar barrages of six rounds. Over to the British side. For the British side, we have infantry squad levels, one SL, two FTLs, two ARs, one LAT, one medic. Platoon Armory consists for one to three squads, two ammo bearers, four plus squads, two MGs, and four ammo bearers. Vehicles, three logistical trucks, 500 ammo, 2,500 build, one bulldog, fob and lid, well, yeah, just fob. Various defensive structures and support consist of four 81 millimeter six rounds and one FA-18 Hornet bomb. With that out of the way, I will now bring y'all in we can listen to uh command possibly do all the fun weird stuff uh phoenix are you gonna take your techie looks like ins nope. is all ready for live or i'm sorry Sounds british good. yeah like, no, i was gonna say ins is ready too they've been ready, been ready for a while now right? yep so if we are live's techies, called make sure we're i'm excited to see how this one pans out if the uh the assault's coming from the south because uh copy it depends on how inquisition sets up his defense and i didn't even go and look at that so Oh, I don't know what's going on in the north, but uh, I've been mainly... South is where it's south. going. Yeah. South has a little bit better natural defenses. Um, uh, they're in a pit like here. The, I mean, natural by the cop. I think the cop <laughs> is a little bit more... Um, they're in a pit. Hard cover. Let's they're call it they're that. in a pit. <laughs> they are in a pit, and they have no screening defense. Oh, good lord. Good. <laughs> Just driving this closer um, so I'm wondering, did they place these uh, Hesco bunkers? No, the Hescos are all all map based. Okay. Yep. I was going to say, that's a random spot to put that checkpoint. Oh, you mean this um, one right here in the middle of the cross yeah. here? No, that that actually is pretty pretty accurate. You stick a uh, uh, someone with a heavy gun in there or a lat, and you've got a straight shot down the thing with some some coverage. Yeah, but the, you know that's also a one-way ticket, too, once you take contact. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're stuck there. There's no getting out. Looks like um, the only... You've got Lawn and Beef on the north, and you've got Jewel here on the south. 
Hey, oh. Twitch. Uh, no. Once you are down, as our op states, one life event, once you are down to the point where it says respawn or wait for a medic, you are counted as dead. At which point, then you are not revivable. Uh, the only thing medics are allowed to do is bandage you and uh, heal you. Uh, they cannot pick you back up. No defibbing. Actually, now that I think about it, they don't actually have defibs. What did the max even do to resuscitate you? They stick a bandage on, bandage on you. Say, get <sighs> up, bud. I liked it. I, I would say I I enjoy the uh, the morphine stick in uh, postscriptum. Yeah, just jab it on. He's okay now. <laughs> yeah, it's not that it works that way, but uh, at least... Um, at least it's a little bit more like they're numb to the pain instead of just putting a bandage on it. We used to do some postscriptum ops, but uh, that game's got to get some more polish to it before we touch it anymore. I know, I know. The uh, those bolt action rifles can be killer too for some people. That's um, I enjoyed it from the Americans, and I get a get an M1. I mean, oh yeah, fantastic. But uh, if I'm sitting there with a car 98, I'm uh, not going to be a happy camper with someone with a semi-automatic weapon. Command Looks one, like Frost is really gun. ready and prepared at uh, Delta 98 um, to be Probably a QRF. <laughs> Literally just a foot outside the uh, cop yep. zone. <clears throat> he is. He is real close to that. But uh, it may come in handy. Command, this is one we're set it is the start point. That's where they started last time. Copy that. Hold what you get. Actually, I overheard uh, EA, and they said they're allowed to move at their own discretion after live scold. Oh, okay. So they can. Uh, they can go wherever. Yep. And I. Ooh, I feel bad for uh, Al and his team right now. They're Command gonna get four. hammered. Four here. I'd encourage you to go another six hundred meters here uh, northwest. That way we keep the enemy. Where are they at the right now? Looking both east Bows and south. Bow's the uh, the southern cop. Oh, is he? It's, oh, it's oh, only yeah. Bow. Yeah, he's the only yeah. squad well, available. Got granted, your QRF. granted, the QRF is only a hillside away. Maneuver, maneuver a bit <laughs> that is true, but uh, they will be on the other side of the fishbowl. Yeah. That with is... three full squads beating down on them. So we'll see how this pans out. Because um, with those two squads trapped in the north, it's going to take a long time to get friendlies in there. Do I hear a plane? You did. I heard that as well. I'm, always, I'm trying to listen for the airstrike, but I never hear one. I really hope we start utilizing some of these uh, these calling assets. I would love to see a essentially a JDAM dropped on uh, some INS forces. And they gotta have the call out too. That's uh, that's the issue. I yeah. think that was the problem with the last Commander ones. They were so spread and they didn't know where anyone was. Need three well, and those lines position. being intermixed, that, you we'll were probably yeah. killed friendlies before you did any other damage. We'll keep our heads down. Oh man, Morgan's squad has a fantastic position up here. They're going to slowly just inch their way westward. Yeah, no, it sounds like Morgan actually, they just said over comms, uh, they're going to get in position, but they're not going to, they're going to keep their heads down. That'll, that'll definitely, um, definitely be good. What's going on up north? Oh, yeah, so this just came over from the EA. Um, the... Was not understood that they could only attack one cop, not both. Um, ah, so, so are we to Utopian to is currently uh, in a loss right now. Yeah, yeah, they definitely that concentration of forces. But it looks like yeah, EA is checking. Uh, one, you're gonna have to stand by. Two, one, you're gonna have to wait for them to move off of that cop position before you engage. Looks like Raggy actually just called out Utopian Copy. squad. Yeah. This is some Go miscommunications ahead. going on here. Confirmed enemies. 
Bob, um, uh, see two or three at the south side. They don't know we're here yet. Oh, uh, have no. they called anyone Four out for the uh, oh, no. southern cop? No, they haven't, and they're sending Frost up north. You're gonna have to let them oh, get off that gap before you engage, unfortunately. Copy. Uh, um, command. Permission to uh, yes. reposition myself. Oh, yep, looks like move. looks like they made a. Okay, okay, they they balanced it out. Frost is Pretty not sure gonna be heading the there. The Raggy said disregard. Uh, the fob here. Yeah, it's um. Just here. Yeah, two. They already made the choice on which fob they were attacking, but the miscommunication was that they could attack both. Oh, no. Yeah. Or at least they could get near both. Remember how we were talking about the first round with Frost being too close to the, the lower cop? Um, well, and here's, yeah. here's the problem, Killer. They spotted Utopian, so they're sending the Bulldog north. Didn't they just say that they were holding it off, or are they still Got sending it? Uh, Raggy reconfirmed it, so they're sending the Bulldog now. Oh, no. Bow is completely on his own. And they are surrounded. Here comes the first and shot. And there's the engagement. We are going to see if there's a turnaround. Oh, looks like the bulldog stopped. Yeah, this is a fishbowl. There, this is a literal fishbowl. This is horrible for defense. All right, this look is... at the INS. They are on the ridge lines at the very top, just shooting down in here. Looks like uh, looks like something out of the western. Might go down. The cowboy sitting pegged. at the bottom of the. Crater with the uh, the Indians holding the top ridges. Oh yeah, looks like the old Rock, westerns I used to watch. Oh, there's a lot. Ooh. Oh wow, that looked Missed. like it almost got bow. Bow's in the crate, so it'll be fine. One, I want you to pull off, and I want you to start moving lads. southeast. Okay, I want you Not to gonna really do anything. Seven, eight. What's the uh, British forces planning on doing? Oh, there went Julia. British forces are redirecting, looks like, um, the Bulldog. Frost is trying to move in to reinforce, but, uh... Oh, man, I hope they try to move on that ridge. Yeah, it looks like Londar or Beef have taken out someone on the INS forces. Yep, looks like, uh, Viper and Beef Anchor trying to pop some smokes to get some cover. Lon's got a perfect spot here, though. Oh, and yeah, he's beef. got a good, good position there. A lot of, a lot of natural foliage time, covering him up. Now. All green. Do we have any... Do we have eyes on leakers? Or do they all appear to be on the compound? That's a negative. It's like Frost Ground is going to get positioning. Looks like they might no be able to cut down leakers. some guys on Zaki's squad. Here. Four, I want you to send a fire Looks like e and Viper are pulling like back up the hill. 250 meters to the outcropping on Delta 99. Once again, that's four one times fire team on Delta 99. Topian and crew are starting to head south. The the remainder of Squad 2 and Squad 3 looks like they're going to start ferrying um, guys with the Bulldogs. Like, uh. Is Zach you there? No. Well. Yep. We did get it. Yeah, we did it from there on 99. That's what I was. Copy. Only, oh. Like, only a fire team. I want us to maintain a little bit of presence. Zach, he's being well. aggressive. Looks like they're gonna catch, uh. Yeah, they're gonna catch Frost in the rear. Oh, this so is leave, not good. Uh, at least two guys to the south. Keep pushing north. Trap taking over squad two. Copy, Viper. Can I get a sit rep on enemy contacts on the northeast side? Contact, uh, northeast. We have no and they've been spotted. The side, but they're coming in from the northwest. Down the goes Hashling Slasher again at the beginning the of the round. Four, be advised, you have contact it's always good. 
Yeah, he is not getting a break. A position inside the Gulf 87 village. I want you to begin sweeping east to west. Frost hasn't even called out these guys. Oh, guys. that's not good. Oh, okay. Zero minus and trigger down below for Eagle. Okay. As soon as you are oh, they are crawling up that ditch. Seven row, are they going to see them? Zero minus. Oh, trigger got Toxic Viper. Eagle still up. Oh, the Eagle. Spacing, spacing, spacing. Oh, man. Lucky that frag wasn't. Yep. About Wolfie pushed so way up front here. Oh, here comes Eagle. Nope, okay, too far. And he's down. So is Zaki. That leaves B car and Wolfie. Alongside Incognito Burrito. Good job on Trigger and Zero Minus being able to uh, repel that assault. Very good. Looks like Morgan had ended up disconnecting. It looks like oh that's oh, not good. Uh, Wolfie it looks just took like, out trigger and zero minus. Yeah, with a nade. It looks like Wolfie and B car are being pulled There's out from the west. You'll have enemy infantry to your northwest. Close. I know you said they were pouring in from the northwest. We have not been able to get our interdiction force between you What's guys. What's going on with these uh, okay. reinforcing? Oh man, the uh, yeah the techie. Oh, this is beautiful. Yep. That techie Just is not armored, yeah. I mean, it is armored, but it's not built for going head to head with a, uh... Especially not a bulldog. Yeah. Utopian, Utopian somehow survived. Utopian is just crawling. He is hoping they don't see him right now. Squad one, you have an LAT and they just... Oh, uh, that is... Otherwise, go to ground, let good it maneuver by Inquisition here. Yeah, fantastic. Command PFIs, enemy um, squad size element is mount from my location. It looks like Phoenix, you know, not to be critical, but okay, they, they didn't move with aggression. We're going into the fishbowl. We're maintaining the eastern side of the fishbowl. They tried to, to just fishbowl, but uh, now they're going to be getting hit from the northeast. Approaching from our northeast. Three is maintaining Overwatch. Phoenix has pretty much started taking uh, full Copy command that. here. Um, Utopian is. They pushed up to get a better eye on the northern part of the compound. Locked down. Understood. Uh, and they are trying to get to people in position to guard northeast. their north northeast. No looking at point proper. Yeah, they. As long as they know it's there, then they they should be in tip top shape. Um, Got to give kudos to Bow and Inquisition. They've been able to hold this cop location. Well, granted, the INS haven't really been pushing into it. Yeah, that's that's one hundred percent sure. I mean. Utilizing these assets, those mortar barrages, is going to be kind of vital for them to take it. I, need an update. I once again wonder if they had stated oh, something died. during the I do uh, too. brief. I do too, because um, maybe, maybe we missed that, but uh, this could have completely changed how both these rounds went. Okay. Oh yeah. If your LAT is able to get a good shot, excellent. Otherwise, keep moving. Break, Never mind. The sea's down. Oh, here we go. Shorty, Vulcan, we and Viper. Within 50 meters of, uh, I'm the making north. contact here soon with Raf. North, north of me. Yeah, copy that. Captain That's Morgan just called out. called out earlier. I need all of two online All their contacts, and he's got a bulldog head straight for him. Contact from the west, let's have you wrap around to two's east. Additionally, copy. bulldog is coming down. Road bulldog has no gunner. Golf eight four five right now. Copy there that. is no gunner so in that bulldog. Well, we've got Inquisition just went down. Oh, that's not good. Well, they're oh, in for the uh, British. Oh, yeah, British forces will definitely move down. Need some solid position there for the uh, oh, yeah. Not no, sure rat. what Shorty's doing. Shorty is uh, definitely. Well, they... Oh, wow. Seneca just got popped. They, no, they gave up that position that uh, Raff and them are holding, and they got caught in the, the rear. Oh, yeah. Looks like um, Phoenix is reallocating his resources to try to deal with what's coming from his northeast. Bulldog is on top of my guy's current. 
currently driving on top of several of my guys. Understood. Bulldog is only being used as a, uh, what do you want to call it? A distraction? Yeah, pretty much. He has got no gunner. There is no gunner in it. It is just there to keep their heads down. Oh, well, maybe Grunt will... That would be kind of as, uh, what do you want to call it? One manning a vehicle. As far as I know, I think that's frowned upon. Viper went down. I need you and your guys to move into the fob and dig down enemy radio if there is no Alphas the behind fob. Grunt with that lat. Maybe he's going to get that shot off. Fulcrum's also got a lat, but he's not quite Alpha's getting lining it. up. Send bullet sponge to Fulcrum. Yeah, it happens, Golby. Let's make sure our guys are not getting tunneled on the bulldog and we're still aware of contact coming in from the north oh, floor. Two good Ooh, hits. Nice double lap. Tandem. Get yourself set up as a listing and post. And looks the like they tracked him. Okay. Yep, yep. He's down. not going anywhere. And there goes Kingsman. Yep. That leaves. Oh, no, I was going to say Uwu is left, but nope, he's down. Kool Aid right uh, Man and uh, Real Prolts. Alpha Disrupt Fox Puppies. Eight. I have no idea how to pronounce his name. Fox A26, heard. Squads 1 and 2, that's southwest of your position, 100 meters. Yeah, that's that's the downside to a one life event, is uh, you could wait all day this for it, you get in, and all it takes is Copy one nade or a shot to take you out. Three no, that is uh, no, to be expected. I'll tell you, Colby, my very first time playing, I did not see a single person and just got shot out from about 100 to 175 meters. And uh, it was frustrating, but uh, played a couple times and um, we'll get the hang of it for sure. Yep, and it looks like the INS are about to get routed. We got Raggy's crew coming up on the rear here. Uh, Bullet Sponge oh, no. about to also become exactly what his name is. I gotta say, Inquisition and crew recovered fantastic to this, because it was not looking good for them. No, they definitely reacted very well to this. Uh, we've got Santo and Bikar down here alongside Wolfie on the entrance of the cop. Wow. Doesn't mean much if they lose all their reinforcements. Can I get a quick uh, life number right uh, for both teams? Let's see. We've got. We've got 10 for the INS, unless some people have been dropped. We lost surprised Florida. Oh, that's not good. Captain Morgan just took our raft, though. do it safely. Go ahead and pull back south. I'm by myself now. They're they're directly north there in Beltley North. Oh, B car just lost everyone. Well, all right, copy that. B car's on his own. Cap Morgan is on his own. Cap Morgan is down, taken out Three, by Flame Mage. I've got um seventh, sixteen, seventeen still left copy alive that. for the. Are uh, you sure that does Brits. not look right? Um, for the Brits. Oh, okay. I was about to say for the INS, that's uh. Not that much. I think there's you got oh, Alpha Beetle Phoenix not. and B car. We're bounding south. Yeah, it's Hanu and, and Kool Aid. Kool -Aid still I now. think Kool Aid's still up and Hanu. Yep. So five v like fifteen. Yeah. What's that? How many does each one have to kill to uh to win this? Looks like each of each of them's got to get at least three kills. Hanu, let's get you moving south, please. I want to set up on the southern side of the fob or southeastern side of the fob. You're clear. I don't know, that actually is still possible if they play their cards right. It is, and you've got some shooters on the INS. One of them being Alpha. You can easily take out three people. Reloading. Let's see how many he's, he's got one right now. Set the lead. Move it. Nice stuff. Keep going. Keep moving southwest. Copy that. Set by the truck. Once you've cut off their line of sight, just keep fucking moving southwest. We're gonna regroup with whatever's left of four. I don't even know if he's still up. <clears throat> Grunt's coming in behind B car. Alpha Guido doing his own thing. Phoenix Grunt. taking Hanu and Kool Aid Man. Back onto the now. B car and the cop. Grunt's coming up right behind him. Uh, 
left, so my north Yeah, I think this is ever. There's, there's a lot of people that do not like this map. I personally don't like any of the maps. I, I, I'm not a, I'm not a very good person at this game. <laughs> All maps are my hated enemies. Slayer, this is the second round of Operation Wicked Turkeys. Yep. We all know what tomorrow is. Yep. Get me some turkey. Some, some good stuffing and all that. Unpopular opinion. Prefer ham over turkey. Hey, well, okay, yeah, that's true. I do like some ham also. Is that a friendly or enemy LAT? Looks close, like close. Uh, Phoenix is close. trying to get a last minute push. Ooh, down goes down. Grunt. B car is still alive. Yeah, what? Yep. I told you, uh, he was just hiding in between that barricade. Okay. Um, Hanu just blitzing forward. Now oh, he's got a heal. Phoenix trying to cover. North. Yeah. Alpha's Bandage veering off can. to the southwest. Yeah, I'm, I'm here. Bandaging. Poppy smokes. Ooh, down, down goes, goes B car. Who got him? Is that uh? Down inside, Hanu. You got contact close west. Copy. Uh, Copy. I don't know who got him. Oh, well, he was out in the either. open, so yeah, a lot of people could have actually been staring at him. Kool -Aid, uh, that leaves Kool-Aid Phoenix and Hanu. Uh, Alpha's still uh, in the back, so he's still up. Oh, down goes Phoenix. Phoenix taken out by either Frost or Pulisher. And Hanu's down by Army Soul. Yep, we just got Mr. Kool-Aid Man and the Alpha Guido. Honestly, I, I've always wondered. I wonder how uh, safe this individual feels by having a mine slapped to the side of their backpack. Who knows? Same thing with people with uh, RPGs. Yeah, sitting true. on their back as well. I lost him. Looks like we've got uh, Salty Toast is going to be reinforcing and hitting them from the rear. I'd say... Um, Kool-Aid is still alive. <laughs> it's armor. I don't know if I trust that one. It's explosive armor. <laughs> <laughs> Most definitely. Yep, Salty's trying to hit them from the rear. But Alpha, Alpha's dug in here. I don't see him going anywhere for the rest of the round. Yeah. Well, something doesn't happen soon. Something's gonna get said by the event admin. Because right now we're at a stalemate. Alpha's taking fire. Let's see if Salty and those guys can uh, an aggressive push on the last two guys alive. Not sure why Guido put that smoke out, but okay. Uh-oh. Army soul. Army yep. soul. Was he able to get back into cover? Yeah, it looks... No, wait, I think I can still see him. But Guido can't. Guido just came out of the little hole. <laughs> Scottish is telling Army, he's saying, I, I do not recommend where you're at. You need to move. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that's usually what happens. And off Guido's going ham. He's just going straight at him. Oh, Kool Aid. Kool Aid's taking some hits. Has he got any bandages? I have no idea. Oh, where is Alpha going? Kool Aid's down, just down to Alpha. And he is just charging. Oh, Scottish. Down goes Scottish. Salty. Oh, oh Salty gets him. Good goal, Salty. And that should be the end of... Yep. Waiting for it. There it there is. GG. Go. All right. Good stuff. Good recovery by the British. Most definitely. Well, with the end of that, if anyone wishes to, maybe not, maybe so, we do have a merch store. We do have Ops merch now. 
So feel free to grab yourself some ops merchandise. Maybe. Definitely Maybe good not. stuff. I gotta, I gotta get me some of that. Oh, yeah. Uh, I gotta grab me a hoodie. Anyways, with that out of the way, I have been Killer Man Time, joined by King, and I hope y'all have a fantastic day, night, afternoon, whatever time it is for you. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.